Good afternoon. I am Dr. Alpana Sovani, a consultant diabetes specialist. And on the occasion of World Diabetes Day, I am here to talk about a very important topic, namely how to prevent diabetes in children. We are currently in the midst of a pandemic of diabetes where India is being touted as the diabetes capital of the world. We are at a 77 million diabetics in the country currently and it is expected to double to 135 million in the next 20 years. In the Amrit Mahotsav year of independence, in our 75th year of independence, I think our first goal should be to do away with this tag of diabetes capital of the world. How can we do this? We need to make sure that we are addressing this important issue that our youth and children are becoming more and more afflicted with diabetes. We need to change that. Normally, children with diabetes is type 1 diabetes, which is an autoimmune illness, and in which, unfortunately, there is little that we can do to prevent it. But in the last two decades, we are seeing an increasing number of young children in the pubertal age group between 10 and 20 years of age who are developing diabetes. Why is this happening? Diabetes is a lifestyle disease, and I'm sure sub agree karing that jab tak hum lifestyle na badle, so ye disease kaise badlenge. So let's make small changes which are going to go a long way. There are four pillars. The first pillar would be diet. Hum, we need to change our diets to a healthier diet, less pro processed food, less junk food. The coca colaization of this generation needs to stop. Less amount of sugary drinks. Increase the intake of carbohydrates, the complex carbohydrates, whole grains. Uh, make sure that protein intake is enough. There is a good amount of good fat going in. We do not need to follow any fat diets like intermittent fasting or keto diets. If your ward or your child is extremely obese and you need to follow these, please make sure you are taking the help of a qualified nutritionist. The next and most important change that we need to bring is the lack of physical activity. Our generation is increasingly addicted to mobile phones, TVs, gaming stations. This needs to change. It does not have to be a, a gym or a fancy Pilates studio. Simple things like walking at least for an hour per day, be it swimming or dancing uh, or even taking up a physical activity like badminton or tennis. All of these will go a long way in helping us reduce the burden of diabetes. We also need to make sure that the children are more mindful, uh, less stress-free, do not have bad habits. Uh, as parents, we need to be a little vigilant of the fact that diabetes is now prevalent in the younger generation. Do not uh, ignore things like if you are seeing excessive weight gain or sudden weight loss. Uh, darkening of the skin, that is acanthosis nigricans on the exposed parts or at the joints, excessive urination, frequent infections, blurring of visions. Parents, please be aware of this. If needed, approach your doctor and make necessary changes. The go-to uh, change is a change in lifestyle with better eating and uh, healthier habits towards better sleep, less screen time, sleep hygiene. All of these small changes are going to go a big way. Thank you.